Hello my friends, today in this video, let's make your own transformer less all-in-one LED driver, AC 220 volt circuit, with adjustable brightness control. All you need some basic electronic components like, a bridge rectifier, a 1UF polyester capacitor, few resistors and zener diodes, LM317 voltage regulator, two pieces of 220UF electrolyte capacitors, a 3mm LED, 5 kilo ohms potentiometer, and two terminal connectors. I first designed the simple circuit diagram for this project, using some basic components like bridge rectifier with other components, and here is the adjustable control part, and with this potentiometer you can control the LED brightness. Then I converted the schematics into the PCB. For easy assembly, I ordered PCBs from JLC PCB. Get 1 to 8 layer PCBs for just $2, efficient large scale production reduces costs, and bringing you PCBs in unbeatable prices. And then I prepared the PCB for its components. So, let's place all the components into the PCB according to the circuit diagram. After completing the soldering process, I cleaned the PCB with isopropyl. And now our PCB looks nice and clean. Now use a small heatsink for regulator. Also use thermal paste for better heat dissipation. Use 3mm bolt to secure the heatsink at its place. Use alligator clip wires, and connect to the output connector. Use this AC plug for input. I also 3D printed this knob, for easy potentiometer adjustments. Before any further ado, let me tell you that you can also order the same PCB for this project, without messing up on prep board. Just go to the video description, and with this link sign up on JLCPCB website. JLCPCB provides easy, affordable, and reliable PCB and PCBA solutions, empowering electronic engineers to develop projects efficiently. Just upload your Gubber file here, to get instant quote and order in minutes, it is easy as online shopping. After uploading, you can see the preview of the PCB. You can also change quantity and color of the PCB as per your requirements. Quality and lead time is reliable, all in-house production, ensuring stability and strict quality control in every process, and lightning fast PCB production, in just 24 hours. And then you can save to the cart for the checkout process. Also don't miss JLC PCB 6 layer PCB special, get $30 off with a coupon, and enjoy top quality 6 layer PCBs, plus 2 UENIG finish, and no engineering fees for wire in pads. Now back to the project, connect the circuit to AC 220 volt outlet. I will use this multimeter to track the output. You can touch the output without any shock, but precautions must be taken. Output can be adjusted with this potentiometer.
For testing, I used this 12 volt LED. As you can see, you can adjust brightness with this potentiometer. You can use different types of LEDs, with different voltages, it will auto adjust the output and will not damage the LED. I even used this 30 volt LED PCB, and it works perfectly with this circuit. If you need output more than 30 volts, you can simply skip soldering these diodes, potentiometer and this regulator, and connect jumper from pin 1 to pin 3. With this you will get higher output, but will not be able to adjust the output. Also on output you can connect 1 to 10 kilo ohms resistor like this. Simply get the positive wire out from the connector, and install resistor instead. Use heat shrink tube, and solder the wire with resistor. With heat gun or lighter, shrunken the tube. Now let's plug the circuit in AC outlet. Connect the multimeter on output. Increase the voltage fully to 30 volts. Now you can test these small LEDs without fusing. This circuit will auto adjust the voltage and will also show the forward voltage of each LED. You can also test SMD LED strip of any voltage, or any type LED bulbs to find the faulty one, so that it can be replaced easily. So, if you enjoyed the video give a thumbs up. For more useful videos, subscribe the channel. Also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.